would dismiss as bhenjis mm-hmm. so we have front and center the bhenji through that game like blurted everything about each other's lives to each other like i hate the word outspoken and bold i'm like do what what does that mean like you know what i'm an i'm an actor and i tell the truth when i'm so if you ask me a question i'm answering honestly does that make me outspoken hi guys this is swara bhaskar you are very welcome to koimoi.com Hey guys, my name is Imran Ismail and welcome to Koi Moi. Today we have Swara Bhaskar in the house. Rather, we are in her house. Okay, I got that right. Swara, so we'll start with this. Okay, I saw the trailer of your movie, Jaha yeah. Chaar Yaar. It gave me a dil chaata feeling with a twist. Yeah. All right, and it's always amazing to see girls going on Goa trip. Yeah. Right. So tell me about this Goa trip. What 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 happened in this Goa trip? And you also reuniting with one of the actors that you worked before. Yeah. In Viridhi wedding. Yeah. So let's start with that. Simple. Yeah, absolutely right. I think that uh, Jaha Chaar Yaar is a friendship film. It's a road trip film. Mm-hmm. The twist is that uh, uh, every time Bollywood has made friendship and road trip films, uh, including my previous film Viridhi yeah. wedding, it's always been. Uh, you know the protagonists have always been cool urban young yeah. uh, you know city kids uh, cool people uh, i think jahan charya takes the genre and adds a really interesting twist which is that it makes a road trip friendship mm-hmm. coming of age film that stars four married housewives yeah. from really small indian towns so people that uh, the more elite stobish people amongst us you would dismiss as bhenjis mm-hmm. so we have front and centered the bhenji <laughs> and we are going to show you how cool how fun how sassy how mm-hmm. badass bhenjis actually are right. and i think i really like that little coup you know that flip that we've done where you know without without i think that's what's special about the film that it it um, it challenges um some of our own stereotypes right. and of course it uh, is a look it's a coming of it's a french film also a coming of age film um about four women who gotten so gusoed in married life and in like you know how marriage has just swallowed their whole identity their whole existence mm-hmm. and how they through this little trip kind of find themselves mm-hmm. and 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 so there's many many elements to it there is there is uh, of course it's very funny it is comedy it's, yeah. it's a really entertaining film it shows in the trailer it's yeah. emotional it's very honest there's a little mystery element also so it's very like it's a very fun unexpected film like what i liked about the film was that i didn't it was unpredictable to me mm-hmm. like when you see the characters they seem like oh yeah we know all these auntie type yeah. people but when the film goes on you're like oh my god wow like that's really cute like we, this we had not thought of you hadn't explored this idea this this uh, facet of someone's personality so the, i really liked that mm-hmm. uh, it was really lovely reuniting with shikha of course correct and um pooja and meher who i had not met before but uh, they were really fun girls that must be interesting and right yeah, it was for really the first cool. time and going on a goa trip and doing this yeah. okay, that's and we took we took the business of friendship very seriously so we were <laughs> like we have to be friends so uh, uh, the first readings uh, the first i think two readings and then we thought let's go on a date all four of us oh, wow. so we went on a group date just to be friends okay. and we were like what should we do so we were like i know what i, I was like i know what to do there's no better way to become friends than play drunk games so shots. we were like let's do shot <laughs> and play never have i ever oh, that's amazing. so that was really that, that was like the so very like so we basically just like through that game like blurted everything about each other's lives mm-hmm. to each other and then there was no looking back after that so then that's after nice. that we were like really you know it was very seamless and easy to kind of shoot with them be friends with them um and i think that the strong point when i watched the when i was dub- dubbing for the film and i saw the i saw the footage i told kamal sir who's the director that you know the friendship is really working the mm-hmm. camaraderie of the four characters that's the strongest point yes, in this yes and you four girls are all four have different personalities in this right yes but what intriguing to me is like your personality okay i've never seen you, seen you in that avatar before yeah. okay <laughs> it's totally what we can say diametrically totally different from yeah. from what you are right yeah. tell me what did you explore while doing this you might have explored something in you right while doing this particular for sure one. i i think that that for me this character is very interesting and special because i've always played very strong characters Correct. on screen mm-hmm. and there's like that persona of being badass. a twitter warrior <laughs> yeah all this like whatever people say like badass fearless is that and i was getting a little tired of the image and mm-hmm. i like i hate the word outspoken and bold i'm like do what what does that mean like you know what mm-hmm. i'm an i'm an actor and i tell the truth when i'm so if you ask me a question i'm answering honestly does that make me outspoken or does that just make me normal honest person and like i'm an actor i'm doing my job whatever the scene is i'll do that scene right. what is bold about that is this basic professionalism True. right so anyway so i just thought that this is a challenge can i play a meek scared 
दबू कैरेक्टर हु इज लाइक द मोस्ट कंजर्वेटिव इन द ग्रुप लाइक शी इज द बिगेस्ट दादी अम्मा ऑफ द ग्रुप एंड कैन आई प्ले हर एंड कन्विंस यू हु ऑलरेडी हैज एन इमेज ऑफ मी इन माय इन योर हेड एंड एज एन ऑडियंस मेंबर एंड यू हैव सीन मी इन अ सर्टेन वे कैन आई कन्विंस कन्विंस यू नो दैट दिस इज नॉट स्वाला दिस इज शिवांगी and that was a challenge for me and i was very excited about that and i think that what this character helped me i modeled her on my nani oh okay i was very clo- I was close going to my to nani like what was the reference point was there like yeah, when yeah. you say husband wo bolta police wala husband yeah. ko call mat karo and you're like no uh-huh, yeah 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 yeah, <laughs> yeah and, and her pet line is ki inse pooch lete hain <laughs> inhe bata dete hain so uh i and i like don't remember asking for permission from like i don't know maybe i asked my dad when i took his car out last mm-hmm. time but like nothing else so i i uh I but I, I I read this character and it reminded me of my nani uh, my nani was a very young bride she got married when she was 15 and a half okay. in like the late 50s early 60s and she um told me a lot of stories I was very close to her she told me a lot of stories about her early married life mm-hmm. and how that was for her and I just thought of her right. uh, when I read this character and I modeled like my character like i took a lot of inspiration from my grandmother so it's a tribute to your grandmother you can say yeah and it was nice i don't know what tribute but it was a nice way to live her memory because she passed away in 2017 oh, right. i've missed her always um so that but um, yeah it's it, it it's i'm i'm really excited to see shivangi and how see what the audience makes of her all right goa trip is always special for us right apart from this tell us some experience from your goa trip have you been to goa before this I've been to Goa a lot. Tell but me a I'm story. The, Tell no, me a story that yaar, that's I so have, interesting no, that we all want. No, the thing is, I have really stupid Goa stories. And <laughs> so very, stupid is best. No, right? I have very like un uncool Goa stories because I am like those people. Jo hamesha, I've never been to Goa with friends. Mm-hmm. I've always been with family or for shoots. Okay. So I've been to Goa twice with family, and I've been twice with shoot. The one Goa trip that I went with friends was a disaster okay. because I went. When I went to Goa, I had a boyfriend. Mm-hmm. By the time I came back, I had broken oh, up. So, so you... <laughs> the one Goa trip was that we went to Goa. It was a group of us, and my my then boyfriend and me had a huge fight, very bad fight. We didn't speak to each other for half the trip. All right. For two days, and That's then on fine. the flight back, we were breaking up. So it was very awkward because we were sitting. It's a forty-five minute flight or fifty minute flight from Bombay, and we're sitting in the aisle in the middle, and there's a poor man in the, or maybe no, we were sitting on window and middle, and this guy in the aisle was just like. He was like, "Man, kaha gir jao?" Like he was just for 45 minutes. The poor guy was just leaning away and we were like fighting with this person. Huh? By the time I reached Bombay, I didn't have a boyfriend anymore. That's an interesting <laughs> story. She's saying it's boring. It's an interesting Goa That's story. Such a stupid story. <laughs> yeah, that was my story. All Goa. right, but uh, coming back to the movie, uh, it's releasing on World Theatre Day, right? 75 bucks for a pop a ticket, right? Uh, What's what's that about? How are you feeling about this thing? Well, I'm I'm just hoping that lots of people. Do you think audience will be drawn Well, guys, please go because now the ticket is half price, so at least our box office collection shouldn't suffer. Like more people should go and watch it. Mm-hmm. But I think it's nice. It's a red pitches that is releasing on uh, mm-hmm. National Cinema Day. Yeah. And uh, I think it's a nice. It's a, it's an interesting move by the producers. Uh, see, it's a family film. I, yeah. I mean, more than how much it costs is that I really hope that people. Actually, go and watch it with families and friends. Like mm-hmm. it's a, it's a, it's a film you want to go watch in a group. Right. Like so, I, you know, this will enable that hopefully.